6,402 sexual abuse cases were reported between 2015 to 2020. The figure from the Children's Authority was shared by Attorney General Faris al Rawi as he piloted the Sexual Offenses Amendment Bill 2021 in the Senate on Tuesday. Rippingly horrific is that the cases for sexual abuse for children include children between the ages of zero to four months. The AG said government is hoping to implement a public sex offender website and part of the amendment includes removing the National Sex Offender Register and changing it to Sex Offender Registers. We are improving the applicability of this part, the Sex Offender Registers, to people who are the subject of conviction in Trinidad and Tobago and people who are also the subject of conviction outside of Trinidad and Tobago. Why? Because later in the Act, we provide that people who are convicted of registrable offenses outside of Trinidad and Tobago must report within two days, if they're spending more than two days in Trinidad, they must report to a police station and have themselves registered. Meanwhile, opposition Senator Jayanti Lajmedial believes a philosophical approach is needed to deal with sex offenders. As she said, a register and a website only address the middle of the problem. We also have to look at the what gets someone there what is wrong in a society when you have these numbers of cases of sexual violence taking place so a register and a website places the burden on the citizen to look around look over your shoulder um, find out who your neighbors are very useful yes but it places the burden on you the innocent party the bill was passed in the Senate this afternoon. 28 members voted for, none against, no abstentions.